Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvania toy collector. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today, we'll be reviewing the Transformers Age of Extinction Autobot Hound, man. And yeah, I loved Hound. He's like literally this character, like boom time. We got the gang back together. I love his personality. This is why I've wanted Hound for a very long time. He's probably the underappreciated character of the Transformers Age of Extinction. And it's a shame they never did more of them, but Hound is just so awesome. And I'm just so happy to own this guy in my collection. He is amazing. I did have a chance to get this figure in the past, the Goody Will Outlet, but his gun arm was broken, so I wound up not getting him. But now that I have him not broken, I'm happy to have him. But before we get down to transformation, we're going to get on to the review itself. And he rolls very well for a three-step changer. But before we get on to transformation, let's do some comparisons with some other Age of Extinction characters I own. Here we got my boy Grimlock. Because you know I like Grimlock. That's the one-step changer. And, of course, one-step changer, leader Optimus Prime. I love Optimus Prime, and I don't have any other comparisons for this video. I'm sorry about that. I don't own a lot of the Age of Extinction figures. But now let's transform him, which is very simple. You're going to pull these out, loosen up the arms, like so, fold this down. This is going to play a key point in the second. See this panel right here? It's going to peg in right up in there. And it's a very simple, fun transformation, if I can get Hound to actually do it. And we got him mostly transformed, and Hound is almost ready for battle. Loosen up his arm, pull these around, and there you got his legs, and now he's ready to go. It's boom time! Take this, Decepticons! Boom, boom, boom! <laughs> I love saying that. I just couldn't help myself. Hound is literally that cool. But he would have had probably some missiles with the gimmick to fire, but I probably don't have them. But the details on this figure are really well done. The head is really well done. I love that. The arms are well done. The body is done. I admit he doesn't have much articulation except for in the arms. No leg articulation because this is a three-step changer, so... He's still very fun. But now we're going to get down to robot mode comparison. Now we've looked at the articulation, which is going to be very simple. We're going to transform the other figures and then do a comparison shot. Let's do it on camera. Because I've been getting people saying I should do this on camera for a while now. And my mother's like that too. So here we got... One step changer, Optimus Prime. Right next to Hound, and he looks pretty cool. Next to Hound. And that's just some random Connectabot sword I have him wielding. Next, we're going to do his Grimlock. And we got this cool looking sword I have for my Grimlock here. Easy to transform. You're just going to do this. It's a little bit tricky on my copy, and I'm afraid of breaking it, so the trick is trying to get him transformed without breaking him, but there we got good old Grimlock next to Hound, and we'll get him wielding his sword, like I do at every other figure. He's got to wield a weapon, but yeah, now he's ready for battle to do battle with his buddy Hound and be like, me Grimlock got your back, Hound. He didn't have a voice actor, which was a shame. Grimlock always needs a voice actor. But he never had one in the Age of Extinction or the Last Night, which was a letdown. But now that we're done with comparisons, we're going to show off how many Age of Extinction Autobots I own. As you can see, I only own three. Do I have plans to track down any more of these? Yes, if I can find them, I'm going to track down more. 
but I'm definitely so glad to add these guys to the collection. They are awesome. If you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it, please make sure to like, please make sure to comment, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. And this is Eddie Hill, moving on and rock on and rock out YouTube land.